Okay. All right, a quick video on how to refill uh, butane torches. So you can't ship them in the mail full when it's over a lighter size. So that's why we sell this lighter size that fits into our um, small torch. So this is the, it's good for small projects. The thing is you have to keep holding down the handle for it to work. So if you're doing big projects, it might hurt your thumb, but it's great for small things. So the lighter that comes with it comes full, but then on the bottom, there's a little um, opening. And then you buy these cans of butane, they're very easy to find and they're pretty cheap. Now one thing to notice is, do you see these two heads are kind of different? I don't know if you can see. Um, this one's a bit bigger, and then this one's small. And you want to always get the small one, because the big one, um, it's more for like camping and fire plate and uh, stoves. Uh, but usually they're the small ones. So all you do is in the bottom of the lighter, just push, and it'll fill. That's it. Um, so that's one. Torch, show you them, pop it in, and come on, see, you're good. Um, if you let go, it stops. You have to pull back the safety and push down. So this is our larger torch, same thing, it's got a bottom butane. It comes empty just because we can't ship this full because of restrictions, it'd be way too expensive. So same thing, put the can in. If you do it upside down, it works fine. Um, sometimes some liquid, some butane gets out, don't worry, you have to kind of play around sometimes. Um, I really haven't decided yet if it's best to do upside down or right side up. You just kind of find a way where it's actually going in. See that, the liquid came out. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that one came out. Anyways, um, these are other torches, they're all standard openings. I just have to fill up, I'm doing a lot of work right now. That one went in really nice. So any butane that does leak out, it just evaporates. So just don't light a fire like, you know, until a minute after if you do leak some out, just in case you go up in flames. But uh, it's not too scary. Here's another torch, exact same thing. Push it in. Sometimes it just goes in nicely, other times you gotta play around a bit, but that's it. And you know, You know it's full when it just starts coming out because it's too full. All right, pretty easy.